Hey everybody, it's Tom, WA2IVD. Hey, I got a quick follow-up to that band scope video on the IC7100. There's a really important feature of it that I neglected to show you, so let's take a quick look at that. We'll go back into the scope menu, and with the scope up, I had showed you that you can press the play button and it will do a scan. What I failed to show you, that's also extremely handy, if you press and hold the play button, it will scan continuously. Now, there's no audio while it's scanning because the receiver is feeding the band scope, but you can get kind of a live display of what's going on on the band. Obviously, you see it changing. And you can tune while this is scanning. So if I Go down in frequency, you'll see the the uh, spikes are moving up. Obviously, they don't stay consistent because as we talked about in the previous video, you're looking at a little snapshot in time as signals come and go. But we can tune around and try to find something, and then, like, we'll try to move that one big bar that was up there. Hopefully, it'll come back. And as we move up the band, hopefully we'll find something here. Now, of course, all the signals are going away on me. But I think you get the point. As I move around, I can put something to the center. There is something there. Let's see how close that is. If we get a strong signal again. And then once I get something in the center, of course, that signal went away. Well, that's pretty close there. If I stop it... We should be pretty close to a signal. Well, there's the one there. Anyway, that is the key point here. Well, that's it. I just wanted to show you the continuous mode of the scanning so that you can search for things on the band, especially if it's more of a quiet day. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm Tom, WA2IVD, and this is Ham Radio A to Z.